Has your boredom overtaken you to the point where you're scrolling hours through social media, thinking about the friends that you cannot hang out with anymore because you're self-isolated, talking to your plushies, and wearing this really, really odd hoodie? Mm -hmm. Well, congratulations. You just clicked on the right video because my name is Shari, and I'm here to cure your boredom. The first thing that you can do when you're bored is to clean your room and I know this might seem so annoying and you might be too lazy to do this but you've honestly got nothing better to do. At the end of the day, you just feel so proud of yourself for having like a clean space. Another option is to clean your closet or your drawers and organize your clothes. Throw out or put aside some clothes that you wouldn't wear anymore. This is some footage of me like a year ago cleaning out like all the toys in my closet and I promise you as I filled them up with clothes, it was so much more organized also while you're cleaning your closet try on some clothes and like make a mini fashion show for yourself you know plan out some outfits for the future and just enjoy it like have like loki have like a mini fashion show and while you're at it also like you can even have like a photo shoot Next option is to pamper yourself. Nobody's gonna see you for like weeks or even months. I don't even know for how long I'm gonna stay self-isolated for, but like why not just pamper yourself for you? Like do this glow up so that once you get back to school you can like, you know, like put on a face mask, paint your nails, um, wax your eyebrows or get your eyebrows done at home. <laughs> Try on some new makeup looks and who cares if you mess up with your makeup? Honestly, nobody's gonna see you anyway. That's a good thing about this. Why would you post this? Why did I post this on the internet? Why did I post that on the internet? While you're at it, try some new hairstyles, like straighten your hair, curl your hair, part your hair in different ways. Like I used to part my hair a lot on the side, but now I also like to do middle parts, which I think has given me a large range of hairstyles. So practice some new hairstyles. And if you don't know already, learn how to braid. I have a lot of friends who've always wanted to learn how to braid. So like, I believe in you, learn how to braid. I used to be absolutely terrible at it, but you know what, you're gonna improve you know try some new hairstyles play around with that stuff so i know we can't go out for food that much anymore because we're trying to keep ourselves at home as much as possible so learn how to cook and if you do already know how to cook try some new things like i've seen homemade ice cream and i even tried to make my own like homemade bubble tea which actually tasted pretty good i just didn't have the boba but like oh my gosh learn how to cook and bake and like create all that sort of stuff try and have fun with it this is probably one of my favorite categories because like my channel was originally based on making things diys origami you name it so make something whether that's origami out of paper i have tutorials and there are tutorials everywhere on youtube i used to make these little like cute paper books oh my gosh they were so cute paint something paint your calculator paint like a hydro floss like even like like feel free to just like draw and play around with stuff like watercolor or sew something maybe even try and transform new clothes and if you don't have a sewing machine who's stopping you like you can hand sew there's fabric glue or you can just like practice sewing in the first place and remember when slime was a thing oh my gosh like let's make slime again even though it's not a trend anymore we can still make it for fun you know what i'm saying like i've had pencil holders that i made back in 2018 and 2017 that i use as room decor till this day and i still have the tutorials up on my channel so feel free to watch them and yeah a lot of this stuff that i'm making right now is on my channel because i love this category so much i love being creative so yeah make something <laughs> guys if you mess up it's totally okay Okay, so you might underestimate the power of this category. I love this category too. So first of all, 
do things to train your mind i know it might seem really cliche but like read a book i mean if emma chamberlain can do it i'm pretty sure you can do it too you can journal write about how bored you are and even try and improve your handwriting like i used to do handwriting practices not gonna lie like a year ago or so and at least tried to improve my handwriting and there are videos out there that tell you how to as well bullet journal i have a lot of bullet journaling videos on my channel that you can watch in the past if you're still at school, make sure to take down some notes, maybe even spend some longer time on them. Practice calligraphy and take down like fake study notes, like really cute study notes. Actually put effort into it since we have so much time on our hands. And if you think your handwriting is sloppy, well, that's why you should try and improve it. Here are some things you can write about. You can write about how bored you are. You can write a poem. You can write a story. I was going to write a story about how creepy school would be if you were like the only one there and everyone was like self-isolated that's an idea i guess write a letter to your future self about everything that's going on right now oh and other things to do to improve your mind is learn a new language we have so much time on our hands and learning a new language takes a long time but even just learning basic words of like korean or something would sound so cool if you like could understand something um currently i'm learning japanese i think it's literally bomb and i love it a lot finally learn how to solve rubik's cube and if you do know how to solve one then try and improve how fast you solve one too because it's pretty fun, not gonna lie, so yeah. If you're Catholic or Christian, the church has probably canceled everything. So yeah, I can't go to mass anymore, which kind of sucks, but that's why um, you can spend more time at home reflecting and reading the Bible. And I've been reading a lot lately and finding some really cool verses. So yeah, that's just another idea. This category is all about sport and fitness. Honestly, being quarantined does not give you an excuse to just sit down on your couch and eat chips. I mean, you could do that in some days, but I mean, find a stretching routine, maybe even try and get more flexible so that you can touch your toes, try yoga, try a small workout, and like run around the house or something, you know, get active and find ways to just keep your like fitness up, man, because this is like no excuse and here is a clip of me finishing up um uh, my dancing <laughs> this morning actually today is the second day of editing this video and i spent an hour learning a dance routine um uh, if you don't know i actually love dance i used to do it at school until like, the rehearsals got cancelled so yeah i'm wearing my dad's shoes right now and i was learning this contemporary dance i'm not the best at dance but that's why i'm trying to improve on it for 2020 um yeah i only started dancing like a year and a bit ago, I think, yeah. So I'm still getting the hang of everything and I'm not the best at it yet, but I'm definitely trying to improve. I'm not gonna show you guys me dancing. I'm just gonna tell you guys that I'm done dancing cause like, I don't wanna have to like do that yet. I'm, I have not confident enough to show myself dancing on YouTube yet. This next category is all about music, so the next couple of clips are just going to be me practicing some random music, so I'm going to list them the things I am talking about right now. So with music, um, learn a new musical instrument or practice the musical instrument you already know how to play. Um, learn how to play a song that, like, learn how to play your favorite song on there, or even just create, like, a new playlist on Spotify or whatever, and, like, listen to a new artist, like, this is doesn't just have to be playing music but also listening to some new music that you haven't heard before or even writing a song which i am working on so stay tuned for that <laughs> things that you might want to add to your bucket list of things to do when you're bored wake up early to watch the sunrise or watch the sunset like i know that we can't go to the beach anymore to watch this stuff but even just watching it at home and just getting a good start to your day i have this video trying to wake up at 5 a.m for a week so maybe you could try do that for quarantine like 
just try and do that and see the impact that it has in your life and finally spend time with your family and with your friends their video chat and everything play games with them and interact with them and do schoolwork with them because you know sometimes we can't help but socialize as human beings If you made it this far and if this video really cured your boredom, I encourage you to hit that like button and as you can see, binge watch some videos that I featured today and feel free to subscribe since you made it this far. Thank you so much for watching, I very much so appreciate it and make sure to stay safe during these critical times. Love you all, Mwah. bye, <laughs> see ya!